Now we already get the to-do status, so we are going to display it and render into the collection group. And first we are going to search these cards and also the field rule and change this to a capitalized letters to remove this warning. So we back to here and search field rule and now we go to remove this or we select all of this and then we convert this to JSX and then we save it. Now if we refresh, we can see the warning has gone and now we can focus on loading the data. So we back to our project and go to the app.js and we can see the list group at here and the first one we just want to loop the first one and the other we can remove this because we will render from the data so if we delete this and save it now we can see we just has one to do items now we back to here and then we go to the app and then we are going to check if loading then it will return loading if error and then this will return p error dot message and then if there is not loading and there is no error it will return the following and now we go to the this item and then at here we use data dot get to do's because you can see this is get to do's and we continue to use dot map and to do and for each to do we are going to render the following so we copy this and then we paste inside the so we cut this and paste inside here so we save it now we also change this to to do dot title and now we can see it got the second to do and this is render from the mongodb and we also need to change this to to do dot detail now you can see the details and the last one is to do dot date and now we can also see the date and as you can see this is not very good for display the time so we need the help of moment so we stop the react app and then we type npm install moment so after we already install the moment we're going to start the uh, react app by npm start and then we go back to the time and then we type moment and then we wrap this the to do dot date and then we use dot format and then we use mmmm and then d d y y and it said the moment is not divided because we have to import the moment from moment and if we add two more y here you can see this is the year and we can display the month date correctly so this is how to render the data from the MongoDB.